Still got the work rolls up. Just keeps on going, keep on going, keep on going. But with the new security, you just walk right through. Almost there. Friday morning everyone out there. Thank it's hot. It's hot. So yeah, if you see sweat starting already, yeah, you know why. So we're both uh, heading up towards the Montu area. Um, and last week we let you guys know that it was Jessica, one of the ride supervisors, that um, was one of our fans. So we're gonna go ahead and see if we can meet up with uh, Jessica and uh well stay tuned we do have a wait time for uh, iron guazi uh, it's going to be 11 15 because by the time we got in here it already had a 65 minute wait Ooh. Ooh. okay all right in line uh, for matu and uh turns out that they temporarily went down so they can add a second train empty. Good timing. So yeah, they're running a couple of empty trains to run a test and, and they all start loading people and this line will start moving real quick. One tip when visit, visiting Bush Gardens during the summer, keep cool. That's all I have to say, just keep cool. Shade, fans, drink lots of water, stay hydrated, but keep cool. Yeah, they can. Yeah, I can see it. So, uh, Jessica, we were told, is not in the panel room, and as you can see, that's not Jessica in the panel. 
Uh, we were told she's over there at Cobra's Curse because Cobra's Curse is currently um, down and so they're working to get that one back up. Chances are she's going to be in the panel and we can't really get to see her. So we're going to go ahead and take a look and see what we can find out with Cobra's Curse. Uh, yeah, here we go, another ride on Montu. Don't you just love the wonderful new paint job? Yeah, preferred parking was practically empty, now it's half full. Like a line. A line. Get in. Wow. And the line to get in is wrapped around the curve here. You can wave to all those people down there. It is going to be a busy day today, folks. Um, yeah, the parking lot does look kind of full. And yeah, there's uh, one, two, three, four, five, five buses! Guys, we finally met up with Jessica. Come over here, Jessica. Hi, you guys. So we have Jessica here. She is uh, one of the ride supervisors, and from all the different questions I asked of all the other uh, operators around here, she is the supervisor for Cobra's Curse and Montu. Yes. yes. And uh, what exactly does a supervisor really do? I just overview the daily operations between both rides. I manage mm -hmm. the brakes. If anything happens, they call me. Ah, uh, and currently Cobra's Curse is down. broken down. It is broken down. It broken down. And uh, I don't think we can get any inside information, or can we? Uh, it's going to be a while. It's going to be a while. So the possible scenario would be they're waiting for a part from Germany. Yes. Yeah, they call Germany. They're waiting for them to call back. Oh, so, so <laughs> there we go. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit. So it's going to be a little bit, folks. Uh, Probably the same thing that's happening with Falcon's Fury. Kind of, sort of. Kind of, sort of. So, we have in, a little bit of inside information, so we have it right here from Jessica. What? You didn't hear the fact that we're waiting on a part from Germany no. from Jessica, just that they put the phone call for a part. Yeah. So, so Neil, don't get upset. Please she don't fire me. Don't <laughs> fire her. Neil, Neil and I are pretty good buddies. Uh, he did a little spot okay, okay. Uh, about a month or two ago uh, when we came out of the new show, um, the Cirque Extreme. And uh, it was the past member preview. So we found him on the outside and he did a little promo. So, And I know Neil, he's a good man at heart. He's always working real hard to keep this park up and running real well. And uh, we, we can't exclude Jamie and Kobe. Kobe? Okay. 
They also are ride operators here at Cobra's Curse, and they do a good job in keeping it running when it is running. So, and uh, say hi to Jessica if you see her in the panel, in the control booth, the panel room, and uh, wave at her when you see her. Of course. Yeah. Anything else? We're good. Should have noticed from the website and the wait times this whole past week that it would have been busy today, but well, we needed to come anyway. We got to see Jessica and uh, well, she's going to have a good, uh, good time on YouTube and uh, well, yeah, there's a like a 75 minute wait for Iron Gwazi now. Um, the smallest wait is like five, ten minutes, but that's uh, Pumba, the Congo River Rapids. Uh, ten minutes, I believe, for Shikra, Tigris, and the Log Flume. Um, everything else is well. Cheetah Hunt is down. Uh, it said five minute wait, but I haven't seen a, a train run yet. Uh, Cobra's Curse is down. And uh, there's a good possibility to make it down for a while. We're kind of in the middle. So, yeah. Here it is. The line is long. Scream stuff. Yep, there's about to be a haunting over here somewhere, and we can't have a visit at Bush Gardens without. Checking out our pink chickens. So good to see them back. Now that we got rid of that bird flu. Nice shot of Iron Gwazi behind there. Don't think I'm gonna make it this time. Nope, didn't make it. We'll have to wait here for the next train. Here we go. We have a whole bunch of summer camp kids. A whole bunch of campers also getting wet. But we won't show you them getting wet. We're gonna show you us getting wet. <coughs> Thank you. 
You ready for another one? What do you think? This time the back needs to get wet. Lens is a little bit wet from the last run. <laughs> so we may be a little bit blurry. The holler screen may be a few months away, but the decorations are starting to come out. Are we all ready for a scream? That's right, holler scream. We'll be noticing a whole bunch of areas starting to be transformed like this. For hollow screen. Who's all ready? Oh, they're still working on Falcon and Fury. Uh, it could be down for a while. We don't know. That's a nice little drop tower that we have here at Bush Gardens. And, uh, yeah. It is currently down. Ooh. Another area being transformed. We have Albert Kemp, Richard Randy, Barnabas Kelly, and an unknown grave. Well, here definitely lies somebody. And uh, yeah, back there for Project Jethro, I did see some more work vehicles. So they are definitely doing something back there on Project Jethro. Now, Project Jethro is the name of the Screaming Swing 
It is not a roller coaster, it is a thrill ride though. And it's a thrill ride that goes back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. Uh, look it up, uh, Williams, uh, Bush Gardens Williamsburg has one. And uh, there's an example of that there and they are gonna put that in the Rhino Rally area alongside Cheetah Hunt and the Skyride. Now we are now approaching the turtle habitat and we got a good view of Big Jim last week. I wonder if any of them were out this week. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. And uh, looks like, uh, yep, looks like Big Jim is up front here. And Bubba can't be too far behind. Probably over there. But yeah, we got Big Jim up here. Hello, Big Jim. Hi, Jim. How you doing, Jim? Now this is the second week in a row we see Big Jim roaming around. Take care, Big Jim. Take care, Jimmy. Bye, Jim. I got to see uh, Big Jim. Bubba was hiding, but uh, coming up, uh, to the train station here. Boo! Yeah, I'm sure that didn't scare you. But trinkets and treasures. Hmm. Be careful. This is another area being transformed for Hello Scream. Now you're probably wondering. Penguins in Florida? They are actually African penguins, so they enjoy the worm. This water is not actually that cool. We're here at Moroccan Delight. We had to get ourselves an ice cream. No, we actually got a banana split. So Maggie and I are splitting a split. <laughs> and it turns out we ended up in a transformation area. So this area is also being transformed into a scare zone or a haunted house or something. I noticed this one sign though, Fanny's Rest Stop, eat here and get gas. Does that mean the food is gassy? Uh, I would, I would t say so. I mean, it says eat here and get gas. Hmm. Get gas from the food. It might be the area for the junkyard. It also looks like a zombie fallout shelter. But behind that wall is some scary stuff. If we were thinking about being a scare actor, 
they are doing auditions. Go ahead and scan that QR code. I'll pause it right there for a moment. There you go. Looks like this is a schedule. Starting the second weekend in September. And running all throughout October. And if you want to buy tickets, buy early and save like we did. There you go. Scan that QR code and you'll be all set with the tickets. And uh, I think that'll be it. I think we'll go ahead and call it a day with that. We had our ice cream. We got to meet uh, Jessica. And... Uh, Got to see some of the uh, decorations being put up for Hollow Screen. Yep. And it's uh, getting close to the very hot time of the day. And uh, yeah, now it's time for us to depart. Until next time. Fair journeys, my friend.